Hey everybody, and welcome to part 7 of God of War Chains of Olympus. So, we now have the steeds free. Well, we're freeing the steeds at least. Apparently we gotta push them all the same way. Wow, that's so epic. Now this we can put in our shield and see what this does. Do we free them? I hope so. With the release of the fire steeds, Kratos was now in the hands of the beasts. And where they would take him, he did not know. Oh my god, I think they knocked Kratos out. As the steeds pulled Kratos away from the grip of Morpheus, they crossed into the underworld. But in the land of the dead, they could go no further, for these beings of light were not welcome in Hades. Kratos found himself on the very edge of Hades, the land where no mortal had set foot. Here, where the souls of the dead walk their fated path, Kratos knew that for him, this was merely the beginning. Oh man, I told you Hades would show up again. This Hades is a little bit different though, it's not as blood ridden and gunky. We're actually on the outskirts, and the other spot was like where we met the river Styx. And we'd be brought to hell, you know? Or to Elysium. The Falls of Oceanum. Or Oceanum. I believe it's Oceanum. And yeah, see, this is not technically the same part of Haiti. So you'll actually adventure to a lot of different areas in this game. Like, well, in the course of these games. And I believe you can actually die fairly easy in this area. Or is this because I couldn't see my shadow when I was younger? I don't know. Because, I don't know, it wasn't until recently where I got better at, uh, God of War. Oh, wait, no, it was for some reason because I couldn't make jumps. Oh, God, harpies. What are harpies doing down here? Why aren't they attacking us? Can push L1 or R1 to drop down, I believe? No, just R1. Anyways, let's open this. Uh, Gorgonai. We're getting pretty balanced on our collectibles now, that's good. Orbeez. Oh, with that, we can now upgrade our Light of Dawn. Though, I, I don't really recommend using it, because it's not really that good of an ability. And Max. we still got two more abilities to go, and we've already maxed out everything. We need 11,000 for this, and we currently only have 3,000, so still got a ways to go, but in reality, it's not that far. Like, not that long. Especially since, you know, collecting orbs in this game seems relatively easy. Yeah, these... Oh, in this game you have to push L and R. Because remember, this is on a handheld, so they needed buttons to work better for that instead of the whole typical R2 button. I don't even know if they... Do they even have R2 in the... 
on the PSP? I don't know, because this is the remaster. Kind of like how they remastered uh, Ratchet and Clank Size Matters on the PS2, but never made it for the PS3. It's like the one Ratchet and Clank game you can't get. Like, I don't even know if I'll be able to play it. Most YouTubers don't play it in the series. Because it's kind of just out of place. Nope, never mind. Gorgons do exist! Kind of hoping you guys didn't exist. Well, apparently you died. Straight up died. Oh, you're gonna give me more than. Oh, goddammit. Boom! This thing has, like, max damage now, so hopefully. Yeah, it does wreck up. Well, that just. This just incinerated her. Poor lady. Uh, they are kind of sexy with their slipperiness. And, hey, dead soldier guy. Oh, whoa. What is down here? Ooh. Wait, can I actually make that jump? Or am I supposed to go that way? I can actually make it up there, so I'm assuming I can go down here. Can you... If you're too close to the top, you can't do this whole slide down thing, so... It does get annoying. Oh... Zell to move. Yeah, I'm kind of doing that. They're kind of slow with this, though. I'm hoping this is worthwhile. There are hidden items in this game, though they are really hard to find. So, good luck finding them. Now, that's just a Phoenix Feather. See, now we're equal. With, like, Phoenix Feathers and Gorgon Eyes. I'm so glad that we, you know, finally balanced out on that. I don't get to record tomorrow, which is really sad, but then I have to record really early the next day, so... Eh, it kind of makes up for it, I guess. Because as much as I love recording, it is nice to have a break and just play some games for the fun of it. Also allows me to beat some games that I've never beaten for you guys, though I don't really own any games right now that I haven't beaten. You know, because I don't have really the money just to buy games now online. What do we got here? Oh, just typical soldiers, okay. Eh, you're not much of a challenge. Don't think that you are, sir. Oh, hey, Ogre! Or Cyclops, I'm not really sure which one you are, but it could be uh, either of them. Oh, he's dead. No matter how big you guys are, you guys do, you do seem kind of weak lately. Go! Dot, damn it. You can dodge. There we go, you're dead again. Wait, is he gonna throw like some random little swordsman in here to get me? What else is here? Oh. This guy right there. Well, he's cutting too. Oh, another big muffin. Ah, I got stuck on the wall. Ah, I didn't even see the action command, that's sad. And your toast. What else are you gonna throw at me, game? Nothing? Okay then. Give me some magic. Mm, anything up here hidden? Pretty sure there's gonna be something hidden, but yep. Knew it. See, we're only 5,000 away from being able to upgrade our weapon. Can I go up here? No, I'm gonna have to do this weird high jump. Oh god, that's scary. Looks like you're not going to make it. A cracked wall definitely has something in it. Oh, Harpies. Harpies generally give me lots of orbs for doing nothing at all. Well, there's some orbs right there. Also a Medusa. Or, Medusa Gorgon. Normally I say, you know, Gorgon, not Medusa. Thank you. There's also another chest there that I want to get. Okay, looks like you can now do it. Without being rudely interrupted by evil beings of hell. I guess Gorgons only exist in hell. <laughs> oh, only two more Gorgon eyes and three more Phoenix feathers in the entire game. I think. Maybe you do get another upgrade. I'm not sure. Wow, we almost have enough orbs. Like, holy Jesus. See, so dude, this isn't very secret ish. If, you know, one of the items that we need to do is behind a breakable wall that's actually harder to find. Like, I swear the real way you're supposed to go in this game is actually harder to find than the secret ways, you know? Like, the secrets, just in general, are harder to find. I need to go up there. I need to go up there, which means over this way I can't make it. So I'm gonna need this.
this to go like over this way, right? Yeah, see, because pushing R1 kicks, I believe in the first game it was R2. There we go. Literally free health for no reason at all, but I don't know, you use more magic in this game than health. Ooh, blood falls. Absolutely gorgeous. Now, this game is creepy, yet it's still epic at the same time. And again, creepy and epic are usually one and the same. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Our, our light attack is literally just the range attack, so you don't really use it in close range. That's, that's why. Well, with that, I believe I can... 11, 20, 11, 250. How many do I have? Oh, we're short, like, uh, man, that's, that's just bad. Do I have enough now? Nope, that was literally worth one. Get out of my way, giant pillar. I guess I'm supposed to push a circle on it, eh? Oh, right here. Okay. Just want to go back here and see if there's anything back here. Oh, no, you actually have to go this way. Well, that's stupid. Oh, this will definitely get us our blade upgrade right here. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Upgrade our blades, hopefully to max, because then we only have to upgrade the uh, remaining items that we have locked. Tartarus Rage. Ooh, maxed out our blades. Seriously. This game is just getting too easy. I think we can still get some more done in this episode. I don't really, don't really think that was really worth an episode. I didn't really do much. The Ruins of Asphodel. Hmm. Interesting. I forgot to grab a drink before I recorded, too. Oh, I lost my sound there for a second. Oh. I guess I'm supposed to hop up here. I was really supposed to know that. Is this a breakable wall? Yes, it is. Chest. Oh, we only need two of each. Wow. I swear this game is supposed to be longer, but... I swear this took me over 20 parts. Then again, I recorded like 10 minute parts and 5 minute parts. And I honestly just recorded to the point where like, I got to save points back when I did no com. If you guys want me to do no commentary, then literally just let me know because the quality will probably be better, honestly, but at the same time, I love just voicing over stuff. And this definitely looks like an enemy fight of some kind. Not sure what, something. Oh. Literally, you just show me a imaginary cutscene for what reason, exactly? Okay, we gotta get rid of the harpies to break the guy's shields, because they're just gonna get in the- Where are you? Goddamn biatches? Oh, come on! Don't throw your shield back yet there, buddy. There! We killed one. Oh, let me guess. You're the next one for the door, right? Yep, you're the next one. Oh, to the cliffs of what looks like literally anywhere outside of the game. Or, like, outside of hell. This game isn't the most detailed outside. Well, the Gates of Hades. The souls of the dead enter through this realm of the underworld through the Gates of Hades. Okay, that's, that's interesting, I guess. There's a health chest over here, right? Yep. Man. Wait, the game can't be that close to being over, though, because we still need two more items, so maybe there is another health upgrade, another magic upgrade after this. Because I really feel like as if that's really it. We've already gotten a lot of the game done. Maybe most people just don't find those hidden items or something. We're just lucky and found a lot more. Let's go this way. I really like the woo in the background. Good thing I'm not listening to my actual computer record like I used to do that. It used to throw me off for commentary so much. Oh, great, we're locked in somewhere new. This doesn't look friendly. Well, it doesn't really look evil, but it doesn't really look fun, per se. Wow, another item chest. Okay. 
Wow, and what happened to the, just like the mixed orb chests? We haven't gotten them for a while. Are you like anything important? You're not even a person. You're not a god or a goddess or anything. Great, this looks like, yep, blades. I knew it. There. Destroy this one guard. There we go. Let's try another one. Oh. You still have half her magic. Like, that's just how powerful that ability is. Like, I swear we can destroy them since they're glowing, but maybe not. Oh yeah, there's nothing here. Let's continue out this way. To a gate. Can I just can I destroy these pots of red fire? Nope, can't destroy the red Oh no, I remember what this is. I remember exactly what this is. I believe there is actually still quite a bit of the game after this. So anyways, in the next episode, we will be attempting to open up this gate. Like, comment, and subscribe.